Windows 10 updating and automatically rebooting can be annoying, especially if you're in the middle of a task or if you leave your computer windows open for long periods of time, expecting those windows and your PC to be in the same state you left them in. Today I will show you a couple methods to stop Windows 10 from rebooting after updates. This first method I'm going to show you is more widely known than the second method I'll show you later on. The first method is to update your settings in active hours. This will specify a time period each day where your PC is not allowed to restart and install updates. To set up your active hours, click on start here in the lower left hand corner, then click on settings. At the bottom here, click on Update and Security, then Windows Update. Under Update Settings, first link here is Change Active Hours, so click on that. And to change the hours, just click on the Start and or end time. I'm an early riser, so I usually have it set between 6 a.m. and 5 p.m. To change it, just click into it. And when you're done, just click on the check mark here. And when you're all set, click on save. Now when your computer requires a reboot to finish installing an update, it won't restart during your active hours. The second method is going to be for those of you that like to keep windows open overnight or outside of your active hours. First let's go down to the start menu. Instead of left clicking on it, right click on start, select control panel, Here in the upper left hand side, click on Administrative Tools. Double click on Task Scheduler. Expand Task Scheduler Library. Expand Microsoft. Expand Windows. And then scroll down until you see Update Orchestrator. Click on it. In the middle of here, you'll see different options. Select Reboot from the middle pane. And then click Disable in the pane on the far right. and then you can X out of those windows if you want. And this will prevent your PC from rebooting after an update at any time. Just remember to restart your computer on your own to finish installing those updates you've delayed. Let me know in the comments section below this video if you learned something new and if you plan to use one of these methods. Give this video a thumbs up and consider subscribing for more how-to videos from Tech Gumbo.